Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jessica Yick, the Dancing Avon Lady, and today we're doing another product review video. Today I'm going to be reviewing and testing out for the very first time the new Face Shop collaboration with Avon, the Ink Lip Tint. So I ordered two of them to show you, and this first one here is the Ink Serum Lip Tint in the shade of Pure Red, as you can see from the bottom. And it is the Serum Lip Shine. It is supposed to be the perfect combination of dazzling gloss with a bold tint and a high shine finish. So I'm excited to try it. That's this one out. And then the other one that I got was in the other finish here. So this one is in Rose Rose. And so this is the tattoo matte finish so it's to glide on sleek and dries down to a silky soft matte finish right now i actually have on the square lipstick which is the flat applicator one that i tried out last time in my last review video that is this one here in rosé pink i wore it for a crazy delivery today i did about 22 deliveries in about two and a half hours so i'm pretty impressed with myself and the lipstick was with withstood the crazy elements in me chatting <laughs> anyways let's get on with this review so what i want to first do is i want to take off this one i want to swatch these two guys for you so you can see the difference and then i'm going to try one on my upper lip and one on my bottom lip We'll start with the lighter color. This is the Rose Rose color, and I love the packaging of these. I love the square packaging. It also makes it easier for storage. I desperately need to revise my storage space for my makeup because I've been buying so much and I've been playing around with a lot, but my makeup space is like cluttered, super cluttered. So I do have to make sure I go through things, throw out really old stuff and kind of purge. Um, okay, but anyways, I am digressing. I digress a lot, are you guys? Oh, oh, I just noticed something really cool, the packaging. The shine finish, the serum shine, actually shiny. And the matte finish one is a matte finish packaging. That's so cute. I love that. That's really fun. So all these products are again for a collaboration with the face shop and they are all made in Korea. For the matte finish one first, which is the lighter one in Rose Rose, it glides on sleek and dries down to a silky soft matte finish. I'm going to do that on my upper lip right now. And what they suggest for both of these is to start in the center and then blend outwards. Ooh. Oh, okay. The applicator is different shaped. Huh, interesting. It's much flatter than our usual doe foot ones. This one is a teardrop shaped one. And they say that the applicator holds more products for a fuller and more precise application. So I guess we're going to test that out. But let's swatch it for you first. So this one comes in eight different shades. Oh, wow. Well. It's a lot... <laughs> It's a lot wetter than I thought it would be. Huh. Ooh. Has a bit of a scent. Kind of like fresh water meets a little bit of citrus. It's a very make you feel happy scent. It's brightening. It's like, oh, hello, good morning. It actually kind of woke me up a little bit because I'm super slippery. All right, here we go. Wow, it's so much wetter than I thought it would be. All right, top lipstick. The color is very similar to the rose pink. It's actually a really pretty color. And the applicator, it's actually, yeah, it is quite precise. I think this is probably the best I've ever drawn my top lip with a, <laughs> with a doughish type foot type applicator. So these are both supposed to be lightweight and long lasting. It's a liquid stain with vivid color. So it, it is very pigmented and it's supposed to last a long time. So I guess we're, this is gonna be one of those videos I have to shoot for the day. It doesn't dry as fast as a lip tattoo, but it goes on a lot more even. Yeah, because that one is like almost like a marker. This one, it's like a gloss texture mixed in with a marker type texture. Interesting, it's almost dry now, I think. Okay, so while that one finishes drying up, I'm going to test and swatch out for you the Hug Red. Here we go. Do, 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 do. Oh, it's gonna be bright, it's gonna be gorgeous. Super bright, actually, it's a very bright red. It is shiny, shiny, shiny. You know what it feels like to me? It feels like one of those like Marvel comic book superhero type colors. For some reason, that's what this color reminds me of. I like it very bright. It's a very, 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 very bright red for me. But I like it. 
I love the red. I think I just, I'm a big lover of red lipstick, guys. Oh, the scent is different than the matte finish one. Is it? My nose plate tricks on me. I think it's a little different. For some reason, the red one, the, uh, the shine one, to me, it smells a little bit more floral. And this one smells a little bit more citrusy. It could also be mind games. Mind games, guys. Lack of sleep, mommy brain, mind games. Is it dry yet? No, bottom one's not dry. I wonder if it's meant to dry. Maybe it's not meant to dry. So the Serum Shine one comes in four different shades, and I'll post those up here for you. They are very lightweight. Um, the top one is dry now. And I think it's gonna transfer. I, I don't think that these are transfer free, but um, the top one did become a much softer powdery finish. And the bottom one is just nice and shiny. The bottom one's really hot, like really hot. All right, I can't wait anymore because the baby's gonna wake up. Oh, I forgot to do my swatch. Oh, I'm out of it today, guys. I'm so sorry. I redonkulously love this red. I've been loving all the red lipstick colors I've been purchasing. Ah, I'm gonna have like a whole wall of just red lipstick. All right. So I want to go about my day and see how long this lasts for, but let's do a transfer test first. Ready? Mm -hmm. Oh, the top one doesn't transfer too much. The bottom one, the shine one definitely is not transfer free, but the top one's pretty good. And the color's still on, so, huh. I want to check in again in a bit. It's been about two and a half-ish hours. Yeah, about two and a half hours since I shot the first part of the video and I ate, I drank, I nursed, and I also licked my lips. And also uh, the baby kind of whacked his hand on my face a little bit and got a little bit of lipstick on his sleeper. So it is a transferable lipstick. The bottom one definitely transfers more than the top one is what I found, but the color has lasted. I mean, it's it, it went from a very vibrant color to more of a stain, which is okay too. The other thing that I noticed too is that it's not as moisturizing as the flat lipstick. And so I do feel like I want to either lick my lips, which I did, um, or uh, put on some lip balm. There is a little bit of a taste. It kind of tastes like how it smells with a little bit more of a full body aroma on your tongue. I don't know how to explain it. But yeah, I mean, it's, it's a really pretty shade. I mean, as long as I am comfortable putting some lip balm on it, then it's good. So for this one here, I'd probably say get it for the color and not so much for the moisturizing effect. It's not... Yeah, it's just, it's just not as moisturizing as what I per personally like, but that's easily fixed with just a little bit of lip balm or a lip ointment. What do you guys think? Which format did you guys like more? Did you like the shine more or did you enjoy the matte color more? Let me know in the comments below. So thanks so much for joining me on this lip review video for our ink lip tint in both the shine format and in the matte format. If you enjoy review videos, make sure you give this video a big fat thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, make sure you do hit that subscribe button as well as that little bell icon beside it so you never miss a video notification. To get any of our wonderful new collab products, make sure you do click my e-star link down below and so that you can see the full range of colors, full range of formulas, and all of the great new products that we have at this time of the year and of course the latest and greatest deals now if you're interested in becoming a beauty boss and starting up your own online business so that you can sell anywhere across Canada once again you can also click my e-star link and also reach out to me so that I can give you a hand and show you how to get started if you haven't yet make sure you do also jump over to my vlog channel our EXRS channel so you can see what goes on in my personal life and meet my new baby because he is adorable and as you can also see how well Jennifer interacts with our new little Little guy. I love you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.